alone. <laughs> a woman who supposedly married a ghost, not the singer, on October 31 says finding a venue to host their nuptials had been a goalish task. Ha <laughs> ha, you got that? <laughs> the singer called <laughs> Brocade claims she was first introduced to her now husband, Eduardo, when he made a surprise appearance in her home last year. But done with daytime life. <laughs> Great people this have seen this man. No, the 38-year-old from Oxfordshire uh -huh. uh, described her partner as a Victorian soldier right. and has even revealed he once literally ghosted her for a week after she appeared on national television. Yes, so Brooke Hardy said it was a mammoth mission to find a church that would bear witness okay. to their wedding. Uh. She said, and I quote, I think there is a bit of an issue with religion and the afterlife. Not all priests believe. She's admitted that she wasn't a believer in ghosts before she met her husband. However, <sighs> Their first meeting left her very emotional and helped her see life after death. Now, the 38-year-old had previously revealed she has been kicked out of churches and even threatened with exorcisms when looking for wedding venues. Uh, she explained how all she wanted was a huge white wedding <laughs> with her nearest and dearest. However, <laughs> she said a lot of people just can't see the vision and they can't see her husband either. But it appears the, the chapel-styled wedding is a moot point, as Bacardi said, Eduardo doesn't feel comfortable in churches. I wonder why. She was also instructed to make him a Victorian three-piece suit for the big day. Instructed you by You see how the tone say, I wonder why, meaning the man is a ghost and obviously demonic or something, but yet when I laugh at the woman, no, 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 she had the husband. Saying, no, 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 you see no, the I'm contradiction saying, in vision no, there? No, no, you see, what I'm saying, so the belief safe no, no, exists. No, 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 no. Nah, Nikita. No, no. I, I, mm -hmm. no, no, what I'm saying, I wonder why she said that um, not many persons can see her vision. Mm -hmm. um, if he's a ghost, then um, I don't think anybody can see him. <laughs> what do you guys in the audience think? Can we throw the, throw the question out to the audience? Well, to tell you the honest truth, this is just one of those things, it's just weird, strange, but apparently she's, you know, um, preparing herself for, in a weird way, waiting for her husband who is somewhere out there, so we can't see. Mm -hmm. Because the truth is out there, right? What's, Nanu, what's Nanu, her name right? and where you're from? My name is Lorianne and I'm from Golden Spring. Golden Spring? Where is that again? Golden Spring, Stone Hill. Stone Hill. Oh. oh, so you're from the Stone Hill as well? Yes. The Golden, okay. So we have the Barbican and the Stone Hill. Excellent. A good dividend. Yeah. Um, you know what I feel that we are going towards, and I don't know how I feel about it. It's like almost anything goes. And we, we've been, people have been pushing the, the, the boundaries for everything lately. And I think, you know, we have someone that married dollies. Don't forget the person that married the doll. We have somebody that married one robot. No, we have somebody married. Somebody I mean, married themselves. Somebody married themselves. So somebody married their child. We had that too. So I'm kind of like we're just pushing the, the 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 boundaries. My question is though, when do we say enough? You know what I mean? So when do we say enough? Yeah. Why? <laughs> I'm not sure how far I'd go. I know you I know need what? a husband, but I'm not sure about the ghost one. I think with, I'd rather just like, oh, just chill out. With that, daytime lab, we'll be right back and we're going to have our first game of the day. Uh, you know, and we're going to have our first guest, Izzy Beats. Hey!